Well, hey, Team Fuzzy Panda viewers, uh, the Hunter here. I'm doing a solo box opening video. Sadly, the specials of everything is not with me today. He's uh, busy and the others as well. So I'm going to go ahead and go ahead and do this box opening video on my own. It's on the new release of the Booster Set 10 Triumphant Return of the King of Knights, which obviously it's the Alfred, but you know, a lot of people are into Liberators and as for me, I'm into the Eradicators. Uh, this is actually my third box. Uh, I did open two boxes already and I basically packed out everything I needed. Well, at least for the Great Threes. So, I got two Descendants and two Gauntlets. So I really don't need to pack out any more, but it, it wouldn't hurt to pack out Descendants since that is the most sought out uh, Eradicator anyway. The only thing I am looking for is the Golds, because I haven't got enough Perfect Shield. So let's go ahead and start this box opening video kind of sad like I said because I'm all by myself but oh well the specials of everything is with me in spirit go ahead and start all right let's see yeah so like I said as I was saying eradicator is what I'm looking for basically got everything and just need to pick the shield especially this is trying to build spikes let me see if I can pack out some more spikes for him I basically packed out almost everything for him too so let's go ahead and start with the right side all right then let's see what we get in the first pack trash all right so i'm just gonna speak to the comments since I'm pretty sure everybody's seen all the comments anyway so uh, oh man well at least i got the first triple r not one i was hoping to pack out since it's not really sought out I mean, some Genesis players use this, but I don't think my, any of my teammates need that. And if they do, they, they, I'm pretty sure they got all of them already, so. <sighs> oh, well, that's okay, I guess. Not a really good start for Triple R's, but what can I do, right? Let's see what's in the next pack. Wingle Liberator. Rare. I'm going to go ahead and just put the commons aside since nobody really wants to see them anyway at least I don't think so rares here foil there let's see next pack another rare this time the genesis starter for Artemis alright next I mean to be honest like I said I'm not really too worried I don't pack out anything good in this box, it's fine. I pretty much got everything I needed anyway. Yay, another Eradicator Caster. Uh, I think this is my fifth one. Oh, wrong pile. Next pack. Let's see. Oh, I think I think I see it. I think it's a double R. Yep. It's a double R. An Artemis. Yay, my second one. <laughs> so far, this is looking like a Genesis box. What can I do? <laughs> oh well, let's keep going. Not, not that I'm hating on Genesis. I'm not hating on Genesis. Genesis are a good clan. It's just I'm not looking for that. And my teammate, Flame of Heaven, already got everything he needed. So, Dudley Manson. Oh, the Great Two Rare. It's actually a pretty good card for. Spike Brothers, it's a superior collar for the clan, so it's really pretty decent rare. Surprised it wasn't a foil. I mean, its effect is pretty good. And again, most Spike Brother cards are easy to pack out since they're all double R's. Alright. Stay in there. Stay in the box. Alright, next is Beast DD Hatred Chaos. I'm actually trying to make this clan. Well, at least not for, well, for later on. But I already got all these, so this is actually my fifth one. Huh. I guess it's good to have extras to trade off, right? Ooh, next pack. Let's see. And that rare Nova Grappler. Armor Heavy Gunner. He's okay, he's with that 12k attacker for rear guard and 
plus 5,000 limit breaker, which I mean, I guess if you use it in an Nova Grappler or any Nova Grappler deck, I guess it would be okay. And I think I see it's a foil. Don't want to ruin the surprise, so let's go ahead and just... And it's an Ashley. That's fine. One of my friends needed this, so I'll trade for it. Pure Heart Jewel Knight Ashley. Ash or Ashil. Or Ash, no, Ash, yeah, Ashley, Ashley. Not bad. So, two double, triple R's already, and one double R. Four to go, and one to go. Eesh. See, what? My last triple R. Unless I get an SP, I mean, if I get an SP, hopefully it's a triple R SP, because I would hate to get an SP that's a double R. That just minuses a triple R. Oh, the Grade 2 Artemis Chain Ride. Now, where did I put the comments here? Oopsie. Didn't go there. There we go. Alright. Not bad, not bad. Like I said, chances are good. I think that's already my sixth or fifth one, so don't really need it. I'm a play set kind of guy, so. Oh, oh, okay, this box made up. Yay, Liberator, Round Table, Alfred. I kind of needed this for my Liberator deck. Liberator is my second deck build. I'm not really focusing on as much as the Eradicators, but this is a good card to pack out. Second most expensive card out of the set, so. No Descendant, but still good. So, all Triple R's have been packed out. One Ashley Break Rifle Jewel Knights, the Alfred, and I will not pronounce that for the love of God because I do not know how to pronounce it. So I'll just call it I. Let's put it that way, right? I. Let's call it I. And Artemis. So all triple R's, four do double R's to go. Let's see what do we pack out. I'm kind of hoping for a gold. Come on, gold. Come to me. Or Halo Mark. Either or. Another Artemis rare. Chain right starter. Next pack. That wasn't... Okay, let's see. I think I got a foil. Oh no, it's a rare. It's that Grade 2 Eradicator. I love this guy, but I already have the amount of cards I needed for this. This is just spare now. But it's still a good card. I want to use it for an extra Eradicator deck that I might trade or sell off. Because I have enough to make another Eradicator deck. kind of saw that already. I think it's another rare. Let's see. Common, common, common. And another Grade 2 Artemis Chain Ride. Two more packs to go from the right side. Let's go. Let's see. Common, 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 common. And the 12k is going to a hitter for rear guard and 5k booster for Vanguard or to increase it. Eh, for Spike Brothers, it's okay. I don't think my partner is going to use that. The specialist who's trying to make their hand. I think he's just focusing on Juggernauts, the Break Ride, which is a bad end dagger, and he wants to do Gully Emperor, but he might have to do the Catapult since he doesn't have enough Gully Emperors at the moment. So, And what do you know? Cheer Girl Marilyn. I believe that's the last one my partner needed for perfect shield, I think. So I'm pretty sure he's set to build the deck. We'll have to do the catapult, but nonetheless, you can build the deck so we can actually have a video with that. Alright. That's the right side. Now for the left side. This is what we get because we're still three triple I mean three double R's away. Let's see. Come on, gold, come to me. I'm kinda worried actually. I need those golds to finish my eradicators. That's all I'm missing. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, focus camera. Don't do this thing. Alright. And Saffron. So 12k, 5k, or 15k, then that's for advantage. Next pack. Come on. Just give me one gold. That's all I want with Tavis. It's all you can pack out of one box. Focus, focus camera. Alright. There you go. And another rare. It's the 
Liberator, grade one that when it's superior called from the deck, you get to draw a card. It's actually a really decent card for now with the Alfred. And if you stuck using that promo card, that uh, Gosh Hawk, it's decent. So not bad. It's not great, but it's not bad, especially for now. It'll probably be better with a Garmor build. Once Garmor comes out, oh, I'm kind of with the camera there. Uh, which, by the way, yeah, we did get a stand for it, so, yay. Oh, I think I saw it. I think it was a goal. Please let it be a goal. I saw it, I saw it, I saw it. Ooh, focus, camera, focus, and yes! Yes! One more goal to go. Woo! I'm almost done with my Eradicator deck now. Yes, thank you. All right, well, this box is already made for it. I packed out the cards I needed and cards that my friends need, so that's good. That's good, that's good. And that's barely the third double R, so two more to go. I'm already happy. I don't even care what I get anymore. And I got what I needed. Uh, the Priz Prismi for the Jewel Knights, grade one. 10k, I think. Oh no, it's something else. Mm. Oh, I'm not really into Jewel Knights. I'm pretty sure you guys know what the effect is. I'm not gonna go into much into it. I'm an eradicator kind of guy. So, let's keep going. Focus camera, focus. There you go. And, Fellowship Jewel Knight Tracy, the 12k hitter for Jewel Knights. Not bad, it's a pretty good card. Most 12k's nowadays don't really make a difference anymore since most Vanguards are 11, so your 12k's are mostly going to be if you have an 8k boost behind it, it'd be only 20, so they'll easily guard with 10 nowadays. But they're still good to have. I'm not hating on 12 plays. They're still good. Linchu. Yay, the starter I use now. Um, this is probably like my 6 1 already. I love its art. I love its art. And I love its effect. It's better than that Spark Kit or whatever you call it, that other old. Our coming starter that would pop zeros. Now you can actually pop ones or zeros. Pretty good. Of course, it only works with right first. And here we go. Ah, uh, I do not agree with this. I don't think they should have ever even made this eradicator card. I'm not saying it's bad, but it's just not for me. Because to me, I think your opponent's still plussing out of this effect. You can easily add a perfect shield with that skill if they happen to get the perfect shield. Next. So it's not really good. You might retire, but you're adding a card to their hand. So. I guess it's okay with the gauntlet, but other than that, I wouldn't use it. Alright, focus camera. Alright. Alright. Going, and another rare. The Mega Blaster for Narcomi. Mm, I wouldn't use it. <laughs> I don't even know why they made Drenica Blasters. They're not even effective anymore. Oh, I saw it. It's a, it's a rare. And I think it's an Eradicator. Let's keep going. Yep, it's the Zooey 10. Yay, Zooey 10. I believe this is my fourth one. Or third. I can't remember anymore. But I know I have all the ones I need for my deck. Keep going. Trash in the box. So one more double R to go. Let's see. Genesis starter. It's not the chain ride, but it's another starter you can use. I believe it's the one you can is it the one soul charge three? Yeah. Counter blast two soul charge three. Uh, I guess it's okay. I mean it just depends on what Genesis build you build, I guess. I believe most people want the Artemis for now anyway. At least until the newer stuff comes out. So I believe most people are gonna focus on Artemis, so until I believe it's what box third no, I think it's fourteen. Yeah, box fourteen, I think more Genesis come out. And then the trial decks also coming out. So. Alright, let's continue. Enough with me ranting. Another Genesis rare. 
one can so charge three. Basically the same thing as that zero. But this has to hit a Vanguard, I think. Yes. This has to hit a Vanguard. Or no, this has to boost and it has to hit Vanguard. My bad. Reversed. Alright, keep going. I believe this is the last foil I saw it and I think it's something I need to. Or something I can trade. I think I have enough. I don't think I'm gonna need more than two. And if I'm right, it should be an Ascrad. Let's see. Saw by the color. Yep. The last double R of this, of this box. Not bad. Two perfect shields, one Artemis, one Zoe Tin, one Ascrad. That's actually not that bad. There are cards I can use, especially that gold. Oh, thank you, gold, for coming out. So, yeah. Another Ascrad. This is my third one. I think I'm only going to run two in the Liberator deck. It's basically another Vivian. I'm pretty sure you guys already knew the effect anyway. But the good thing about this guy is that he doesn't have to be boosted. Pretty good. But I think I'm only in two. So this is probably going to be trade or sold to one of my friends in need of the Liberators because they're all, some of them are making Liberators too. So. Let's go ahead and I guess recap real quick. Not only do we need to look at the rares, these are all common, so I'm thinking we need some more to see that. So double R's. S Crag, Louis Tang, Gold, Maryland, and Artemis. Triple R's. Alfred, yay, the main card of the booster said. One in the cover. Ashley, yay. And I'm gonna try Iwana Gahime. I can say it I guess if I say it slow, but I can't say it fast. Which is really okay, but not the most expensive Genesis card in the set. Basically the same price as Artemis, so not a good triple to pack up, but eh, I guess I can make do with it. So that's about it. So hope you guys enjoyed this box opening video. I know I did. And at least I got what I needed in Alfred and Gold. So yay. Hmm, thumbs up. Uh, so that's about it guys. Oh wait, 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 wait oh, I have more cards. Oh. Well, I'll go ahead and open these packs. I didn't notice. They're just rares, but I'll open them anyway. Oh, I can't believe I missed two packs. Let's go ahead and just go real quick, because we know we're rares. Genesis. And the last pack. Doesn't hurt, I guess, because some rares are good to have. See, this is a good rare. Uh, another Genesis. All right, that's about it. Okay, now we're done. Now we are done officially. So that's it, guys. This is uh, the Hunter from Team Fuzzy Panda signing off. Peace.